just to book her to babysit, right? This I'm making up the book her to babysit. So it's like if you call and say, okay, I need you to babysit this night, she's going to charge you $5 for that. And then she charges you, I believe it's something like $3.25 an hour. I'm making this totally up, okay? Right, and so they have to figure out that it's 5 plus 3.25 H. H, right. So one way that, and that's all they should be able to have to do. That's it. So where you can get them then is just say, make me a table of some values. So here's the number of hours and here's how much it would cost. I'm putting this one in the middle for the math. Okay. Okay. So if I don't, suddenly somebody calls and cancels, so I don't have to babysit any hours. How much will that chart cost me? Zero. No. Five? You booked me, so you have to charge, I'm gonna charge you still $5. You call up. Well, that's not fair. That's not how babysitters do business. Well, we can make it electrician. We can make it anybody. Okay. But okay. you the can change the context. The body, or I'm going into a movie theater. I've got to pay $6 for the ticket. We can change the scenario to whatever. Mm -hmm. The issue is before I've even done any hours, I have to pay $5. This is where two steps come in, where there's something that happens before the per one starts happening. Okay. Okay. And then ask them, well, what would you do for one hour? And the way the table needs to work, this is what confuses kids, is to have like a table where somebody walks in and they go, you work eight hours, tell me how you get the answer, okay? So it's not that it's building. You're just making a table of values for how you would get it. So if I did this for one hour, I'm going to charge you $5, and this column is to write the math that you would do. $5 plus one hour at 325 okay so that total becomes 825 okay go to the second hour if they do about three of these they'll get the hang I mean it, mm -hmm. so the second hour I'm going to look at them going well they're gonna to have to charge me five dollars to book me and then I go there and I babysit for two hours so that's two times 325 because so a lot of kids will say, well, I just keep adding 325, which is fine, but I want to see this in here. So 2 times 325 is 650. Add that on would be 11, um, is that right? 1175? No. Yeah. 2 times 1150. 1150. Yeah. 25. And you see how this just keeps going, okay. right? That's for two hours. So, so what happens then to get the expression Right here, what I need them to know is that the expression tells me the math to do. Okay. We're not going to have as much time to teach this as we hmm. would. You don't need, because if you'll do this, if you start with the one step and show them and build it to this and then jump into this one, okay. they'll just follow right along. So, so we're doing, so Monday I'm 